Well, this month you can walk a point five K. That's right, point five K, featuring two Abilene breweries, food trucks, and much more. Here to tell us more about it is Terry Cable. Thank you for joining us today. Oh, you bet. Thank you for having me. Point five. Point five. Five hundred forty-six yards. Okay, this is for connecting caring communities. We had. Um, you on the show yesterday, mm -hmm. so explain to everyone what Connecting Caring Communities is and where did you get this idea? Okay, well we are a nonprofit that works in the neighborhoods of Abilene and encourages good neighboring mm -hmm. all across the city. We target a couple of specific neighborhoods where people that live live in the neighborhoods, mm -hmm. but uh, we got this idea from uh, somebody down in Bernie. Okay. And we said, Oh, that's a great idea. And so we said, we can we can do 546 yards. So, so this is the race for the rest of us right. who don't like to run a lot of miles. Right, exactly. Yeah. And it's got two breweries involved. Yes. Pappy's and Sock Delager. How did you get them involved in this? Well, I just we just thought, you know what? It's probably about the right distance between them. So I just went out and asked them and they said, "Man, that'd be great. We would love to have they love having people." Yes, they and do. So we want it to be an event. Uh, so we've got food trucks coming, and the Queen from 102.7 will be out there live broadcasting, mm -hmm. and it's just going to be a fun time. And this was a fundraiser for Connecting yes. Caring Communities. So how important is it to keep your nonprofit going and to get neighbors to know their neighbors? Oh well, it's obviously anytime you're a nonprofit, fundraising is very mm -hmm. important, and so we just want everyone to come with their neighbors uh, because we'll have a great time and without fundraising and mm -hmm. without people who support us on a consistent basis many we would well we wouldn't be yep and so we're very thankful for the opportunity and very thankful for Pappy's and Sock Dodger and their partnership and allowing us to do it down China Street now before the show, there's free beer involved, but not for everyone. That's right. Tell us how you can win free beer. Well, the, we're going to draw two lucky people who get free beer for a year from either Sock Dodger or, or Pappy's. Pappy's, okay. And that doesn't mean they can go every day because they're only open on the weekend. Yeah. So it's like a glass of beer a week. But it's worth it. But it's worth it. So yeah. this is if you sign up for the race, correct? Right. Now, well, it's really a walk, not a race. It's we're a not walk. racing. No, we're all going to no, walk no, no. and get we're, to know each other. We're meandering down the street, you know, yeah. and we might order lunch on the way as we okay. walk past our favorite food truck. All right, and if we sign up this weekend, you get a discount, discount. correct? Discount. Yeah, this this weekend, it's back to September prices. So okay. instead of 35 it's $30. All so right. go to our website. All right. WeCareAbilene.org, and you can find out. All right. Sounds like a lot of fun. So if you want to come out and join the Good Neighbor Point Five K, it will be it will start at Pappy Slocums, and then just up the street at Sock Dolliger on Saturday, October 27th at 11 a.m. Registration is $35 or 30 right now, and we'll have a link where you can sign up along with this interview on our website, thecountryhomepage.com.